How's it going everybody and welcome back to Lead Therapy and thank you so very much for taking time for tuning in to my video. In a tweet from the office of the Governor of California, Gavin Newsom, and let me read this for you. If states can shield their laws from review by federal courts, then California will use the authority to help protect lives. We will work to create the ability for private citizens to sue anyone who manufactures, distributes, or sells an assault weapon or a ghost gun kit or parts in California. Before we get on further with the video and I explain how he thinks he's going to be able to do this, if you enjoyed this video or if I give you some information you didn't know, please take time to like, share, and subscribe and hit those post notifications. It's greatly appreciated and it helps the channel grow. Gavin Newsom says he'll use Texas abortion law as a model for gun control measures. In responding to the U.S. Supreme Court decision allowing the Texas abortion ban to stay in place, California Governor Gavin Newsom on Saturday said he plans to propose a gun control law that would be modeled on the Texas one. Newsom said the Supreme Court decision has set a precedent that will allow states to avoid federal courts when enacting laws. The Texas law allows private citizens to sue anyone who helps a woman get an abortion after a fetal heartbeat can be detected. I'll put up on the screen the full statement from California Governor Gavin Newsom so you can read along with me. Governor Newsom issued the following statement on U.S. Supreme Court decision on Texas abortion law. I am outraged by yesterday's U.S. Supreme Court decision allowing Texas's ban on most abortion services to remain in place and largely endorsing Texas's scheme to insulate its law from the fundamental protections of Roe v. Wade. But if states can now shield their laws from review by federal courts that compare assault weapons to Swiss Army knives, then California will use that authority to protect people's lives where Texas used it to put women in harm's way. I have directed my staff to work with the legislature and the attorney general on a bill that would create a right of action allowing private citizens to seek injunctive relief and statutory damages of at least $10,000 per violation plus costs and attorney's fees against anyone who manufactures, distributes, or sells an assault weapon or a ghost gun kit or parts in the state of California. If the most efficient way to keep these devastating weapons off our streets is to add this threat of private lawsuits, we should do just that, December 11th, 2021. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section down below about Gavin Newsom's proposal. And as I mentioned at the starting of the video, if you enjoyed the video, or if I gave you some information you didn't know, please like, share, and subscribe and hit those post notifications. And I'll see you guys in the next video.